Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another f episode of Fallout 4 Survival Mode. And, well, uh, this episode we're gonna continue on with, uh, oh, hello there, dance. <laughs> we're gonna continue on with the Lost Patrol mission, or quest. I keep on calling it a mission, but yes. Let's continue on with, uh, with the Lost Patrol. Y you know what, actually... I, I am going to get sidetracked a little bit because I actually kind of want to uh, investigate this uh, this building a little bit more because I know, I don't know if it's a little bit too early or not um, for me to be able to do this. Oh, some stuff. Because, uh, yeah, oh, wait, oh, expert lock, uh. But isn't there a password somewhere? I could have sworn there was a uh, password. Oh, yeah, this here. There it is. Password thing. There we go. We can use the password. There we go. I didn't open the door the for first time. The d oh, man. I, I said door really weird just then. Ugh. Oh. Uh, is there more ghouls around? I think there's ghouls outside. Oh! Well, oh, this is kind of awkward. Oh wow. Uh Did did they go through the load zone? Oh, okay. Well, there's Oh god. Okay, there's a legendary. What is this? Uh Ooh. <laughs> yes. Finally, we got a lucky weapon or we got a, well, I mean a, a legendary weapon that's actually really good, a lucky <laughs> Oh, lucky shotgun! Don't leave anything behind. Yes. What exactly? Um. Uh. How does this compare to our? Uh. Uh. To boom boom. I I forgot to go over the weapon weapon names I done last time. Uh. Anyways. Um. It's I I can switch around components and everything, but that's actually not that bad damage to start out with okay i am i am definitely going to keep it around going to do some switch over but my goodness is is that i is that really good oh you scared me there Sneak attack! To be honest, I mainly am going through here just for the XP. Taking out these ghouls are pretty is pretty um easy so far. And I say that and I'm gonna get cursed with something. Uh, turn you off. Is that the only feral goal I can see? Uh. Okay, let's just go ahead and take care of this ghoul. This one. Ah, some more viable blood samples. Uh, 
Did I just hear a door open? Why am I in danger? Oh, because of that. <laughs> That's... <laughs> That didn't know if I was gonna be able to kill him with that first shot. Okay, so not that bad of things. As I, ooh, okay, I didn't mean to. Uh, here, dance. You carry, carry, you carry these missiles if you can. Oh. Um. I didn't see this glowing one. How? Okay. How did that? How did they not? Okay. I'm just not gonna question it. All right. Yeah. That's that's good. That, that that's good. We. That's good that we had that. <laughs> Was able to. Oh my goodness. That would have been terrifying. Oh wow. Two viable blood samples from that. You know what? These are actually some proper beds. So. Uh. What's actually is our... Ooh. Do we actually want to get rid of all that adrenaline? I definitely want to at least save, so... Uh... Yeah, I think six hours is still gonna... Uh, take most of it away, but I want to get rested at least. Alright, so... Yeah, that's where we need to go over there just over yonder, and I'm hearing gunfire already. Hey. Uh, it's on his work. uh, hello? What is, what is, I come outside and it's chaos already, what the fuck? It, <laughs> idiot. Yes, I, what is, oh, all this over some float, float flies, I see. Hello, Doc! What else is there? Oh, there's Mar Lurks. Hold on, what? The Mar Lurk is going after Idiot! You idiot! I don't want to accidentally shoot the... The, uh, the Mar Lurk. Or, wait, wait a minute, the fucking, uh, I mean, no, I want to shoot the Mara, look, I don't want to shoot the, the, the Brahmin. Idiot, yeah. Good on you. Oh my goodness! Oh, I better get away from these people! <laughs> they, uh, d Doc? Hey, get away from me, Doc! What am I getting in danger from? Uh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Just, no, that's not what I, I want! To... Oh my god! Okay, Dance just started his own war- Oh my goodness, what, what is going on? This is fucking chaos. Ex I mean, ex I mean, it's typical Fallout, just explosions everywhere, I guess. What is up with this one super mutant? He's just taking all these shots. Oh no. Uh, get some shots into that super mutant. Now I'm in danger. Now I don't want the fucking um, missile launcher person to get me. Hello. 
Hopefully I don't become a skeleton in here. Hello, idiot. Okay, so those are actual... Okay. Oh, no, no, wait a minute, no, those are the... That's the enemy. How am I missing these shots? Uh, why are you bringing other outside things towards us? Oh my goodness. This is... This is absolute madness. I don't feel all that confident going in. Especially with that... With, with that around, because it, it's gonna crash any minute. It's already at health, half health. And it's losing parts as we speak. Okay, where there's a Brotherhood Knight. Where, where are the super mutants? Oh my goodness, there's a legendary. Is that it? Okay. Ooh, stat. Ooh. Hold on, let me actually see how good this actually is. What Chance to chance to stagger on hit. Hmm. I am gonna take this because I I mean my current sniper I don't currently have a, a legendary sniper and I might actually start carrying a sniper rifle again since I now have a legendary. Now don't get me wrong, there's a lot better legendary effects, but I mean that's actually pretty decent. I'll I'll leave you there with the skull. Um, although that's shit. I'm, I don't have that much carry capacity. Dance, where are you? Might as well give him the lucky sh combat shotgun as well, because I mean, if I do have to use a shotgun, I'm gonna, just gonna go ahead and use my normal shotgun as well uh, for now. So uh, is this it? Okay, yeah. Ooh, three antibiotics. Dance, you scared me with that. Oh, there we go. Ah, this is Ferris. It's been two hours since the paladin left. My leg. I can't staunch the bleeding. Uh, the bullet must have hit an artery. Brandis, if you get this, I hope you... Made it back to Aslan in time. There was nothing you could do for me. Ah, get to the bunker up north. You will survive. That's all that. Uh, all that matters. Probably trying to send word back to the prison. Ferris was wounded. He couldn't walk. He got a distress signal. And Brandis left him behind. He broke the first rule of small group tactics. Stick together. Always stick together. They all wound up alone. And they all got killed. Damn it. That just leaves Brandis. He always was a survivor. But after all this time... The tape mentioned a bunker. I think I know the one. It was part of my original mission. Let's move out. But yes, this bunker is all the way up north so it's gonna actually be huh I, I actually never have heard him <laughs> say that voice line before oh wow I'm finding a whole bunch of antibiotics all right let's head on out and uh, try to make it to the bunker Let's go ahead and try to complete this mission, and then we can take a Verter bird from that location uh, back to the Pridwin or wherever we, wherever we want. Oh, uh... Hmm. I hope this is not a... I, ho I hope that's just a random traitor and not a part of... Uh... The idiot... The caravan with the idiot. Oh! What's this now? Uh, 
Uh, T-51. Hmm, does it have a... Oh yeah, it has a fusion core. Okay, that's actually... This is actually interesting. Where exactly is this? I think I might come back for this, because, hold on, what do we have right now? It's... Is it... T-60? Yeah, th I think this is better. Yeah, it, it for sure is, but... I mean, it's still a chassis that we can use in the future, so. Oh yeah, we have a level up, so we might as well uh, take it. And you know what, since our playstyle kind of relies on it so much, I'm going to take an extra point of agility so we can finally, next time around, start taking ninja to increase our sneak attack criticals and I mean besides charisma and of course intelligence because we eventually want to get science um, besides those two I think that's going to be uh, kind of the last bit of perk boost or uh, special boosting that we're going to have for a bit I mean we definitely want to increase our perception just so we can have penetrator a little bit down the line but even then, even then, that's not. And also, concentrated fire is, is also a useful one. But that's I don't know. I'm I'm thinking I'm thinking that's more handy later on, like further on down the build. So, but I kind of need stuff at least for now. I haven't taken any ranks of sneak, which is you know kind of counterintuitive, which. Uh, oh, I can already take three ranks of sneak, so I probably should start doing that here soon. Anyways, go ahead, go ahead and take another uh, boost to agility to um, go ahead and get ninja. And um, and I'm pretty sure there is like some bobbleheads you know around uh, for agility and perception. The only reason why I'm boosting it so heavily right now is because. Um, uh, well, not exactly for Blitz, but I mean, it's like, like say if I was to, you know, uh, boost it to 9, uh, boost Agility to 9, and boost uh, Perception to 9, like further on down the road and whatnot, I can then uh, find the Bobbleheads. I do believe there is a Perception and Agility Bobblehead that do increase it off the top of my head. I'm going to have to actually look it up to actually make sure... But then that will max it out, so... I mean, because either way, you're gonna have to put the perk points into it sooner or later, even with the extra boost. Um, I'm not quite exactly sure where the bobbleheads are off the top of my head. I know for certain where the strength bobblehead is, and a few a few other ones, but I'm I'm definitely gonna have to actually have to look, look them up, so... Yeah... Also, down to 11 power, uh, or 11 fusion cores, which, uh, you know, uh, wait, forged, uh, pyro, oh no, this is, this is not good. Oh, hello there, Stingwing. Now, what exactly is happening over here? I mean, they're marked in red, and if I remember, the forge is not a good bunch to be a part of. Oh. Okay. Running, 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 running. Okay, wait, what? What in the hell was it? was was that just Did I stumble upon upon a uh, new content new update quest by accident? What the fuck? I am so confused right now. 
Well, hello there. Uh, Hellfire. Oh my goodness. That's it's not even better than my. Okay. Well. That's what I think of that. Okay. What what is even going on over here? Like, just the lovely. What a lovely place you have right here. I'm glad I stumbled upon it. Yeah, let's uh, let's go kill the alien. Oh, oh no! I think I remember the spot. Where did the Protectron go? Oh, right there. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that there. Yeah, we just took out the defenses dance. I, I think it actually still is uh, inhabited, as you would say. Now, I'm gonna have to be really careful, because... Because uh, this part of the map is very dangerous. Uh, okay, I mean, I see those fragments, but why am I in caution? Oh, yeah, no, yeah, no, no, let's, let's go away from that. that. That's instant nope. That's just instant no. Let's get the fuck out of here. Great, I'm stuck in, in between. S oh, wait a minute, no, that's, ex that's an actual settlement. I thought that was a super mutant settlement for a second. Hello, good people. Do you uh, happen to know there's an assault drum just down the road? Uh, what, with raiders? I'd be glad to. Just tell me what's going on. We're having a lot of trouble with a group of raiders. <laughs> <laughs> if you have a moment, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. Oh? Of course. What's on your mind? Thank you. This isn't a formal meeting. I simply want to clear the air. I think we may have gotten off on the wrong foot when we first met, and I feel like I owe you an apology. Expecting you to embrace the standards of the Brotherhood without having a history with us was unfair and given that you've adjusted so well to our beliefs i don't think i needed to push so hard you worried that i'm gonna quit no i just felt it was the right thing to do when i was an initiate my sponsor was paladin creek toughest squad leader i ever served with he was a model soldier embodying the values every trainee was striving to achieve fiercely loyal secure in his beliefs and brave to a fault from the moment i was assigned to his squad i was singled out it felt like he was pushing me harder than the rest of the team. I fought by his side for years, and we had some seriously close calls. But he never explained to me why I was treated that way. It sounds like he was trying to motivate you. If he was, I never got a chance to ask. After I was promoted to Paladin, and I had moved on to my own squad, I received word that Krieg was killed at Adams Air Force Base. The news was like being kicked in the stomach. I mean, I'd lost some of my brothers and sisters before, but his death, well, it really got to me. It's taken me a long time to realize it, but the reason Krieg was so tough on me is the same reason I'm so tough on you. It's because I believe in you, and I don't want to see any of your potential go to waste. What happened at Adams Air Force Base? Back in the capital wasteland, the Brotherhood was at war with a traitorous group of rebels who called themselves the Enclave. They maintained a mobile command post at the remains of Adams Air Force Base, just outside of Washington, D.C. The Brotherhood spearheaded an assault on the command post, which was ultimately successful, but costly. Quite a few soldiers died in that battle, and Paladin Creek was among them. He made his mark on history. And whether you choose to believe it or not, you have the potential to do the same. I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. Just keep doing what you're doing. Well... I've said what I had to say, and I hope that it meant something to you. I trust you'll keep this in confidence, of course. 
some of that information was of a personal nature. And, well, I'd like to keep it that way. Ah, uh, uh, and as you can see, it was very easy to at least gain the first step of, uh, I guess, affinity. I forget exactly what you call it, but it's like the first um, uh, friendship rank for dance. Is, I don't know, whatever you would want to call it. Um, I thought that was an electrical thing. Uh, but yeah, it it's very easy to get dance to like you uh, by getting in and out of your power armor and and everything like that. Although I wasn't exactly expecting a good yeah 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 good for you. But yeah, it's um it's very easy to at least with dance to gain a. Um, is to gain points and whatnot just by getting in and out of your power armor, riding the vertebrate, just general things like that. It's surprisingly very easy. <laughs> oh? What is going on here? Oh, there's a lot of sting wings. Really? Really? Alright, I guess we're... Why is there only seven? Okay then. Uh, I guess his leg. Dance, I need you up. Well, you were talking about the Enclave, huh? They, they fucking are here. What the hell? Wait, what the fuck? Dance. Heads up. Hey. They've Heads up. Switching out. Watch it. They've gone dark. Ah shit. Okay. I guess I was trying to give him this, uh, this flamer, or incinerator. You gotta be kidding me. What? Wait, what? <laughs> what the hell? Oh my goodness. Oh wow, that's actually hold on. How much better is that armor? What? Uh Wait, how is this zero weight? Hey, can you carry all of this? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh wow, I find it kind of crazy how you can just switch out the the st stuff. Huh? All right, what the hell is this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, I want to take this, but at the same time, uh, I don't exactly want to, like, <laughs> uh, you know what I can do, though, is I can go to this bit of the road right here. Yeah, and then drop it. And drop all the bits and pieces off. Uh, Dance, don't kick them around. Come on. That messed with your pathing a little bit. Alright. Could m place a marker right here. And then come back for it. 
Because that would be a nice thing to have. But at the same time, I don't exactly want to take it. I, I mean, I don't know. It's new content stuff. I mean, it's, it is a lot more protective and whatnot than what I currently have right now. But I would rather just not use it because it feels a little bit cheap. Or, I don't know. And plus, it, I, it feels a little wrong uh, using the Enclave stuff. But I don't know, that's just me and my, uh, my own kind of role-playing perception or perspective. I mean, if I really wanted to, you know, min-max or whatever, my armor and everything, I would actually swap shop out my uh my stuff and everything but as far as you know this playthrough and everything like that i do kind of want to just not uh you know not use enclave stuff because i don't know as far as you know brotherhood it's not you know doesn't exactly uh scream uh the fuck doesn't exactly scream like they would use um a course. A fucking course. Get me the stinger! Hello there. I see that you're looking at me. Uh. <laughs> okay. Well, at least I could still have, you know, at least I could actually still loot you, so. Ooh, cures addiction. Oh yeah, that's actually really useful. I will use up purified rotter for that. Uh, I'm, I went to get into my armor. <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't appreciate you. I don't exactly appreciate you, like, staring at me whenever I get in my armor like that. It makes me uncomfortable. Hello? Anyone here? I should actually probably go ahead and get ready. Oh, actually, what do I have for charisma boosting stuff? Uh, I didn't actually bring any great mentats. Uh, dang it. Alright, let's, uh, tr uh, meet up with Brandis, I think is his name. Brandis. Freeze! One more step and I'll, I'll, I'll blow your damn heads off! Paladin Brandis? Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Dance? It's Dance. Paladin Dance. Don't you recognize me? Dance? No. <laughs> what the? What the hell's up with this camera? Why are you here? I was dispatched to the Commonwealth on a recon mission, Paladin, just like yours. How did you... Hey, I guess he finally made it into the building. I've been alone. All alone. For so long. How long, exactly? Because, uh... It's never really stated exactly how long you've been... I don't, I don't know. We followed the distress beacons left by your team. And plus, the bodies aren't skeletons. The others? What, uh, What happened to them? And in classic Fallout fashion, you know, I mean, you know, skeletons, you know, can can be pre-war, but at the same time, it's been proven in the past that some of the skeletons aren't pre-war, so, I mean, <laughs> yeah. They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. You, you, you did? Thank you. This, this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you've been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If you see anything you want, take it, take it. Come back with us. You're still a member of the Brotherhood, Paladin. What? No, no I couldn't. Not, not after everything that's happened. Uh, let me uh, 
Let me put on my suit. Look alive. Awaiting your command. Here. You handled yourself well, mate. I guess. Okay. I appreciate the backup. Of course. Paladin Brandis is a good soldier. He deserves better than this. It may be a long time before he's fit for duty again, but I'm glad to have him back. Captain Kells will want to hear about this. Let's report in. And I agree. But first, let's uh, take this fusion core. Wait, why why was you keeping Psycho in here, huh? I actually I don't want to know. All right, hopefully this uh, signal grade doesn't glitch out. Yes, because uh, sometimes you can throw a signal grade in a bad place and it just it doesn't want to work. Actually, you know what we should have done? Uh, you know what? I'm not really that worried about it. What we should have done is we went back to the, this custom destination, threw, threw a signal grenade there and whatever, but it is what it is. <laughs> Ooh, it's a misty day now as we rode into Boston or flew into Boston. Hello, dance. <laughs> Just sitting there looking all serious. Another car fell down. Like, I want... I wonder what's ha happening to cause that. I've seen that sometimes before, but not as often as, as it's been happening lately. Oh? Oh yeah, the racetrack! Can we see the robots going around? No. I must say, I really do like this, this um, whole uh, docking process with the vertebrate and everything. It really is a uh, neat part of the game. And I, in, in survival mode, it really does, I mean, there really is a reason for you to use it. Hello there, Captain. Hold up, Knight. Let me make one thing clear. As a member of the Brotherhood, you serve under my command. If you want my respect, you will have to earn it. When I give you a mission, I expect results. Is that clear? Uh, I mean, hot damn. Okay. Uh, sure. Perfectly. Good. I'm aware of your search for the missing recon team. I want that resolved. Do you have anything to report? I've completed my investigation into the missing recon team. Paladin Brandis was the only survivor. Brandis, what happened to him? I convinced him to return to the Brotherhood. Well done. It may be difficult for him to adjust to life in the Brotherhood again, but his experience should serve us well. Very well. Is there anything else? Do you want their holotapes? Thank you. I'll see that they make it to their next of kin. I could have sworn I gave Brandis their holotapes. I, I went... I mean, but I have their tags. Is, is that what they... I, I honestly don't really know. That's all. I'll prepare a full report for the Elder. In the meantime, allow me to offer you a new suit of armor. Bear it with distinction. Oh, yes, this. Uh, yeah, it's not really that great. I... <laughs> when it was like a new suit of armor the very first time I uh, completed this mission, I was like, ooh, nice, what am I going to get... And yeah, this, it's a very, it's very disappointing, this. This was no easy mission, Knight. Well done. Now, I have a more pressing matter that requires your attention. I've received reports that supplies have been disappearing from our supply depot at the airport. I suspect... Oh, this, this mission! Inside job. An inside job? Do you have any suspects? This is treason we're talking about. In a case like this, you are either sure or you are not. Until then... Everyone is a suspect. I want you to take charge of this investigation. Report to Knight Sergeant Gavel at the base. He commands our logistics division. He can familiarize you with his unit and the depot. Beyond that, you have leave to conduct your investigation as you see fit. Report your findings directly to me. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I expect results. <laughs> what the hell? 
Of course, it's it's the NPC doing that. That, that that's great. Uh, Dance, where are you? I need to give you something. Oh, I was look. Yeah, I was looking for you. The captain said you could brief me on the missing supplies. Well, let's take this somewhere more private. Follow me. We've converted this section of the terminal into our primary supply depot. Everything the Brotherhood needs to operate passes through here. Supplies from the Pridwin, salvage from the field, handle it all. Access is strictly limited to the logistics detail, and we track every crate, every bullet, every bolt that comes through that door. I mean, I guess this is a little bit more private area. These accusations. I know every soldier in this unit. The thought that anyone would question their loyalty makes me sick. If you've got questions, ask. Otherwise, stay out of our way. Watch your tone, Sergeant. Sir. Tell me about the logistics division. I've been in charge of this unit for almost ten years now. We're a small group. We stick together. And we keep the Brotherhood running. Tell me about the missing supplies. We're down over twenty crates, if you believe the scribe. All food. Dried meat, instamash, mac and cheese. It doesn't make sense. I could see someone stealing weapons or tech, but our thief goes to all this trouble for a lifetime supply of cram where should i begin my investigation you shouldn't this is a waste of time i've already spoken with my men they haven't seen anything tegan's scribes just fouled up the books again if you insist on questioning someone go bother lucia or clark i can spare them lucia and clark knight lucia and initiate clark they were just posted to this detail a few weeks ago. They're still learning their way around, but I'll have them in shape soon enough. If you have to badger someone with your questions, it might as well be them. That's all for now, Sergeant. Take my advice. Poke around a little. Then tell the captain to let it go. It's not worth your time or mine. So yeah, that's one of the things that kind of that kind of annoys me is he's just he's so dismissive or whatnot because there's obviously supplies missing but he's like no oh no it couldn't it couldn't happen it could not possibly have be happening but yet there's obviously food going missing but whatever oh i'm sorry i don't think we've met knight lucia logistics what can i do for you knight i'm conducting an investigation into the missing supplies the captain appointed an investigator is it really that bad? I'm not sure I can be of much help, but, um, what do you want to know? Do you know anything about the missing supplies? Not really. I've heard it's mostly food and, um, vacuum tubes? No, sorry, they just lost those. You lost some vacuum tubes? How often are supplies lost around here? Someone had just filed them in the wrong place, apparently. Clark found them the next day. A little things do happen, but it never amounts to much. The sergeant may complain, but Proctor Teagan and his scribes are very thorough. One or two crates, maybe, but not this many. Okay, yes. See, the... Okay, that, that makes a little bit more sense. It, like... Like she, what she just said is like, you know, maybe one or two things, yeah, sure, but it's like crates upon crates of food going missing. It's, yeah. What's the security like? It's tight. At least two knights and a scribe on duty at all times. And we've got the entire base right here. We don't have much to worry about. Is there any way to get past all that security? Hmm. Well, you'd have to be in logistics. We're the only ones authorized to bring supplies in or out. Then what? Well, there's no way you'd get a full crate of supplies off base. With all the patrols, someone would notice. But why steal anything in the first place? The Brotherhood provides everything we need. No one here has any connection to the Commonwealth. I don't know. None of this makes any sense. What's it like working in logistics? It's not a bad post. Sergeant Gavel is tough, but I've learned a lot from working here. I guess some people take to it and some don't. Like Clark. Ooh, hold on for a second. 
What about Clark? We joined the Brotherhood around the same time, about two years ago. Yes. We've always been friends. Well, until recently. Why? What happened? I don't know, honestly. Fuck! He's just been distant lately. I'm sorry. It's probably nothing. That's all for now. Let me know if you need anything else. Now, where was I? You hear about the thefts, right? Look, I already told Sergeant Gavel everything I know. I'm conducting this investigation, Initiate. I have some questions for you. Oh, this is a formal investigation now? Look, I want to get to the bottom of this as much as anyone. What do you want to know? Tell me about the missing supplies. I really don't know anything. I've heard the rumors, same as everyone else. But that's all. What rumors have you heard? Well, they say raiders with stealth boys hit the terminal every night. That supplies disappear faster than we can bring them in. It's a lot of garbage. I usually work the night shift. Believe me, the only thing you risk dying of is boredom. Tell me about the logistics unit. There are what, ten of us now? Something like that. Our division reports to Proctor Teagan, up on the Pridwin. Sergeant Gavel handles day-to-day -day operations. He's run logistics for years. Other than the sergeant, there's Lucia, me, the scribes, and a few other knights who aren't fit for field duty. Lucia? I'm sorry. Night Lucia. We were both assigned to- Ah, shit, I wasn't out of the armor. Whatever. That's all, Initiate. Sir? You! No luck? I told you it was a waste of time. Listen. I questioned every soldier in this unit. I didn't find anything. You're not going to find anything. If you insist on going through with this, stop bothering my men and go look for some real evidence. Hell, you've got the captain's backing. You could search every damn berth on the grid, and no one would raise a finger to stop you. Now, is there anything else you need from me? That's all. Hmm. Prick. One thing I do find kind of annoying, though, about this mission is how it's like, how it points you to the Pridlin and Prid what? Prid Pridwin and to the like Pacific uh, lock uh, lockers or whatnot that you need to search. Attention! This is a reminder. All recovered technology must be presented even immediately say, to Yeah, it just says for search evaluation. for evidence. And yet Anyone it's... found in possession of undocumented technologies will be subject to inquiry and punishment. Nice. Uh... Oh, oh, it's just from Lucia. Yeah. Uh, have you been in my locker? Uh, after all we've been through, it looks like this is too much. Oh, oh, look, this is too much even from you. Touch my things again, and I'm reporting you to the captain. <laughs> and I'm reporting you. And there we go. I'm definitely gonna have to clean out my inventory. Oh, there we go. <laughs> and last, and of, co of course it's always the last one. This is getting out of hand. Clark has been uh, late to his shifts three times this week each time. Found him. I found him and made sure he didn't forget again, but I can't keep covering for him like this. I think Sergeant Gavel has been starting to suspect something is wrong. When I got back to him last night, my foot locker was a mess. I think Clark has been going through my things. What's the matter with him? Why won't he talk to me? So yeah, I... It sounds like someone who, um... He's very closed off at this point. Greetings, Knight. Attention, all personnel. 
I'm disappointed I need to address this, but unsanctioned social contact with Commonwealth natives is strictly prohibited. Anyone who is engaged in such fraternization should report to Night Captain Kate for immediate decontamination. Wait, what? That is all. Oh, great. I don't know where I'm dropping to. Okay, there we go. What confront gavel? This is kind of new. I found Lucia's journal. She's been covering for Clark. Reading diaries now, night. Petty discipline is my job. I will handle the men in my unit as I see fit. This is none of your concern. Now, is there anything else? That's all. Hmm. You've been covering for Clark. Why? What? What are you talking about? Yeah, I, I find that very interesting how the... I, whatever his name is, the person we just talked to, how he uh, dismisses uh, that fact so... so readily. It's just like, isn't that suspicious at all? I don't know. I read your journal, Lucia. I want to know what's going on here. You what? I... I... All right. Clark and I joined the Brotherhood around the same time. He's been my closest friend for years, but since the battle, I feel like I'm losing him. The battle? Battle for the airport. It was our first real combat mission. It was something to see. The Pridwin coming in under full vertebrate escort, guns blazing. We were one of the first teams to hit the ground. Dozens of ferals. We opened fire and cut them down, and hunted the ones that tried to run. It was everything I had hoped for. But Clark, he hasn't been the same since. It's like he's just given up. Since then, I've noticed him slipping off by himself, once or twice a day. I never thought much of it, but do you think you could follow him? See what he's doing? His shift should be over in a few minutes. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm worried about him. War tempers the strong and breaks the weak. If that is what happened, he wouldn't be the first. It's not much of a lead, but let's see where it takes us. All right, that's it for today. <laughs> I love that. It's just how immediately, like, well, that's it. It for today. That's it for today. Don't worry. I. I'm supposed to be sneaking. Bullshit. Yeah, see, this is totally shadowing right here. Totally shadowing. Thank you. I really appreciate this. I, I thought you was upset at me for reading your. You know what? Never mind. Wait, what? Did Clark already go inside the door? Okay. That okay? That that's just weird. Because the first time he wouldn't actually go until I peeked my head out and actually got myself seen. But now, whenever, uh, whatever. That's very confusing. Survey team said they collapsed. What's he doing down here? This place would elicit fear in most individuals. Fortunately, my training prevents. Wait, what was that? <laughs> Time to take out some ferals. Alright, just uh, shoot him in the back then.
Okay, good. Got the legendary down. Okay, Dan's got got that one. Ex <laughs> Exterminator's knuckles. That's that's actually. F I'm gonna take those just just for the walls. Oh, whoops. Hello there. Uh, yeah, that's that's kind of my main concern as well is things going boom Why am I in danger though? What's what knows that I'm here? Oh That that knows what okay, I see What was that? I guess I exploded. Alright, that, that worked out pretty well so far. Or at least this is working out pretty well so far. Good old sneak attack. No. Okay, then I guess I will just go after this one. Thankfully, it's very easy just to take them down as they are as they are getting up. That was just the darkness has always been All right, critical on the glowing one. Oh no. Hello there. You're gonna die now. Are you just gonna float to the car there? Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a ghoul! Take him down! Wow, that was a very uh, weird way to get to me. Oh, okay, then I guess I can't take you out. That's very strange. Oh, hello there! Oh, it's not train, damn it. Like, I really wish hacking made sense to me, but it just, it doesn't. Like, I, it really doesn't. Like, I get the idea, but whenever you go to try to fucking do it, it you're just better off just fucking doing random ass shit. Which is not really that good. Yes, take out all those ghouls for me. Yes, let's how about let's um deactivate the turret now. How are you still alive?
I think your friend blocked some of those shots there. Just taking him down! Let's take down the ghouls, ow. Wait, did you just shoot me? Oh, yeah. What are you doing down here? I was investigating the missing supplies. It looks like I found them. Damn it! I thought I was being careful. Someone was bound to catch me eventually. I can't keep this up forever. All this food? Have you been feeding these ferals? Yes. It's been working, too. What do you mean, it's been working? Why are you doing this? It's a long story. I had a friend who was a ghoul once. As human as you but the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood says ghouls are abominations. They all deserve to die. Would you kill him too? Just because of who he is? Was he a feral? What difference does it make? Weren't they all human once? I joined the Brotherhood two years ago. In all that time, I never doubted our beliefs. Never questioned them. But during the battle for the airport, ghouls, they just kept coming. They started running away, but we, we kept going. I killed them. I killed them all. Well, look, I, I get the sentiment. I, I do because, I mean, because, look, uh, ghouls are, you know, are, and whenever I say this, I, I, you know, I'm, you know, ghouls are, you know, are people for the most part when I say that. Um, I'm also including ferals in the case in that case basically meaning that um, there is a difference between a, a ghoul that hasn't gone feral yet and a ghoul that hasn't went feral yet if they went feral then I mean it's then they're basically you know a zombie and I know that term is defensive in the fallout uh, universe, I think. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't know if that's... I think it is established in 3 that is offensive, but... But yeah, it's... They're they're basically... They're basically zombies at that point, where, they're, where you know, they attack people for no reason. So yeah, that's... I mean, it. there's a difference between, ghoul, between ghouls and feral ghouls, and... It, yeah, it's... They were ghouls. Yes! Damn it! They were people first. After the battle. I mean, I, I get that sentiment, but I mean, I they're feral. I found this place, and the ghouls. What could I do? Report it, and they'd all be killed. Ignore them, and they'd attack the base. I thought, if I brought them food, maybe they'd just stay down here. There wouldn't have to be any more killing. Do you? Do you think I did the right thing? What are you going to do with them? I don't know yet. It's not easy, is it? And, and what about me? Uh... I don't exactly want to get out of my armor, so I'm just going to say... You should turn yourself in. Yeah. What? Yeah, no. I'm pretty sure that, yeah. You know, I, knew... Captain, I won't even get a fair hearing. You've betrayed the Brotherhood of Steel. That's unforgivable. Then do what you have to do. Okay, I didn't realize I was immediately going to start a fight like that.
There really wasn't any other way. There really wasn't any other way, Dance. I'm sorry. Oh, there's the other ghoul. If that's what I think it is, it's not gonna be good. Why? They do this on purpose, don't they? Peekaboo! Peekaboo! Oh no, that's a... That's a putrid. Dance, are you gonna... Are you gonna get him? Wait, uh, how did the... How? Okay, hold on, we gotta level up, right? Uh, let's let's get a rank of ninja. Oh my goodness! Finally, yes, we're getting good critical hits. I think there is still one more ghoul though. Oh yeah, just a roamer. Ah! Okay, I did not expect that to happen. Goodbye. Now, I don't really get that, like, I mean, if, if Dance was so proud in his, you know, brotherhood standards, then why does he get all upset if you take care of, uh, of, um, not Lucia, but Clark, yeah. Like, it, I couldn't convince him to turn himself in, and the only, uh, like, in the only other way was to let him go, which I didn't really want to do because that felt wrong Th that just felt wrong of letting him get away with stealing stuff so and yeah that yeah can i talk sorry. to you about clock sorry i need to fill this order if you need something report to sergeant gavel ah you must already know the news Hopefully your crew members won't actually, you know, glitch you on top of the, uh, instrumentations again. You completed your investigation into the missing supplies. The ruins beneath the airport are filled with ghouls. Initiate Clark has been stealing rations to feed them. He was... what? God, you're... you're serious. He betrayed his oath to the Brotherhood, stole our supplies, and tried to help those abominations? Where is he? What happened to him? He's dead. I expected as much. It's a shame. I had high hopes for him. Very well. We'll consider this matter closed. I have some caps for your service. We have squires in need of training. They're young recruits. What the hell is that? Follow. Someone to emulate. I think it's time for you to pass your skills on to the youngsters. Are you ready to mentor a squire? Uh... Sure. Do not doubt your abilities. Come see me when you are ready. Okay, good. Because I do not, I do not want to do that, at least for now. Wait, hold on. What? Brandis. <laughs> Paladin Brandis. Well 
get back to my old routine, though. Now, listen, I didn't have a chance to thank you properly before. I want you to have my old gun. Kept me alive all those years. Maybe it can do the same for you. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, uh, thank you, but no thank you. Thank you, Paladin. It's not exactly regulation issue, but I hope it serves you as well as it served me. I'm not sure I still have a place here. I've been away for too long. Maybe I'm not cut out for the Brotherhood anymore. But I'll give it time. I owe it to you and to my team. Thank you for giving me another chance. The fastest way down is jumping down. Huh, I wonder if there's actually... Yeah, I think you can actually get to this. Um... Oh my goodness, I'm forgetting the uh, term for it. The... Oh my goodness, the, the whatever thing. Uh, anyways, let's call Vertibird down and head back to Hangman's Alley. And we, and we're gonna end the episode there. Uh, or not right now, but once we get back to Hangman's Alley. And let's go back to Hangman's Alley. Mainly to drop off all the stuff that we have. And I guess um, I should explain that we're primarily going to use Hangman's Alley as our own personal base. Uh, and not so much a place where we send our followers and stuff like that. I'm planning on using a different settlement for that in the future. I mean, but I mean, we're only like, what, about eight parts in to this playthrough, so it's still very early early days uh, any more super mutants no okay who's shooting at me Is it... I don't know I'm just firing randomly now Oh, I think I made Swan angry. Uh, I'm hearing the rocket launcher again. Well, I. Well, that wasn't fun for you, I bet. Where did she go? I... Muster blast her, blasted her into oblivion. Wait, dog meat? What are you doing? What are you doing all the way out here? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's this, it's this one. Oh. It's this random event. I have came across this before. Thank you, dog meat, for coming out of the uh, settlement and to help us there. Chaos Junction, where random events can just spawn there, and why it's also kind of kind of dangerous to actually um, fast travel with a vertebrate to this location, because as you can see, there was a random raider just waiting for us as we was landing. Oh my goodness, that was comical. Just... That was very comical, just... That raider just sitting there... Uh, this is gonna be fun! Gets blasted. 
There, there is actually one thing I'm wondering. Uh, okay, this, this, okay. So this uh, sniper is actually better in every way possible. Suppressor is under rank three of gun nut, so that's that's all right. Okay, so this would actually use most of our screws, but we would gain dramatic range and accuracy. But then again, uh, we could also make a drum mag. Yeah, you know what? I because I can see us using this a lot more in the future. What we're gonna do is, yeah, put a reflex sight on here. Put a drum mag on this, because. I mean, yeah, it says if you're a reload. Um, but, uh, I... I mean, you know, if you have a drum mag, you're not going to be reloading all that much. And the only thing that we're not going to be able to do is a uh, long, long barrel. Because we are lacking the screws with, which is fine. Um... This sniper rifle is pretty all right to go for now. Um, would would have liked to kind of up the magazine, but eh, it's it's all right. So yeah, uh, give me a second. All right, after uh, oh my goodness. All right, after uh, sorting through our weapons and and our gear and everything like that, I think we should call it a part there. That was a very eventful episode, I must say. Um, didn't uh, didn't realize we were going to um, do the investigation mission. Um, I kind of forgot what um, kind of forgot what uh, what everything had to do with that. I mean, I kind of knew the end result, but I kind of forgot the whole journey, how the how we got there in in a sense. Um, but. But yeah, still that w that was fun. Hopefully we can um, get into some other business because we've been doing some brotherhood, uh, a lot of brotherhood stuff as of late. So let's uh, let's try to do some uh, other stuff in the future. Ran into some, I'm guessing some uh, up, uh, new content update stuff again, um, or next gen update stuff, which I didn't want to run into but i mean i guess here we are and i'm kind of glad we didn't exactly or we didn't run directly for that because yeah that was that was very difficult and tough uh to run into and i can only imagine what it would have been like if we was even higher up in, in levels so i i guess that was a i don't know i guess that was a sweet spot but yeah anyways Oh my goodness, that was a that was a very chaotic episode, if I do say so myself. But yeah, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, if you liked it, please give it a like. And if you want to see more content like this, please hit that subscribe button. And yeah, I'll see you freaks and geeks next time. Bye. Yeah.